give y'all a couple little parenting tips, some things I wish people might have would have told me when I was coming up. Things you might already know, things you might not know. But it's just some good information to begin with. Alright. Uh truth be told, man, children gonna cost you money. My son, like everything that could be broke, he gonna break it. Uh let me go down the list. He done broke cameras. Uh, controllers, uh, glasses, dishes, uh, Mac computer, you pour water on the keyboard. Uh, I mean, you name it, man, the kid will get to it and wreck it. And the killer is, like my son, he talking about a little, little infant, two-year-old, you know, that type of thing. They're young. They're young when they're doing this stuff, so you can't really discipline them. They don't know what they're doing. It's different when a child gets to the age of, you know, three, four, five, six. But well, just for a youngster, you can't tell them nothing. So I tell you this: if you got uh, electronics, things of that nature, don't let your children around them. Don't take it for granted. Don't think, oh, it's safe. He's just a kid. He don't know what he's doing. Cause he not knowing what he's doing is what's gonna cost you money. You know, I, I sit there, I clown, I laugh, I say, man. I'm going to have to put, I'm going to have to make like a, a, a tally for all of the different stuff that he break. So when he get older, I'm going to take it out, take it out from his, you know, from his tally. I'm going to just go around breaking that stuff saying, look, now we even. But, uh, yeah, man, children, they going to break your stuff. So know that, know that ahead of time if you about to have a kid and uh, just be ready for it. Uh, if you see on the back wall, I guess over here, never mind, right, right there. Uh, you get markers, you get colors, you get crayons. Well, they gonna color on your walls. And I got to touch up paint to paint it and, and, and fix it back up. But you know, you just gonna color on it again. So, so I'm gonna wait a little bit till I feel like kind of out that fade, and I'm gonna go ahead and dress it up. But uh, yeah, man, children, they color on walls. I tell my old lady, uh, my wife, all the time, look, don't be buying all these crayons and stuff and giving it to them, man. Or, or, or control it better, cause you know, a kid going to be a kid. They're not trying to draw on paper. No matter how good your intentions are, they're going to find a wall, and that's what they're going to color on. Let's talk about toys. You know, my son is addicted to Thomas the Train. He's addicted to toys, all kind of trains. If you buy your kid a whole bunch of different toys, do not, I repeat, do not, do not, do not buy him toys with a bunch of small pieces. The more pieces to a toy, the more you're going to have to clean up. The more pieces that's going to be sprinkled along your floor, the more headache and confusion it's going to give you. Now, if you're one of these little richy, rich, rich peoples, and you got a maid, you got some house cleaners, you got some people who going to come do your stuff for you, well, that's different. But if you like me, and you you handling your business on your own, look, a child, they, they you know, they going to do what they do. Um, other advice I always give, man. Breastfeed if you can. Like, have your children breastfeed. I got friends who don't. And hell, come to find out, I wasn't even breastfed, but I ain't better. It's all good. I'm still smart as hell. But nah, uh, breastfed children are just healthy. You know, I got friends who don't have breastfed children, and their children are always sick. I mean, they getting the vaccines and all that good stuff, and them children are always sick. My little dude, that boy don't never get sick. Like, dude go to sleep naked on a regular. You know, when I grew up, it was like, man, you better go to sleep with a shirt on or you're going to catch a cold. Like, that breast milk got power. They got built-in vaccines and antibodies and antivirals and antibacterials and all that stuff built in from Mother Nature. That's why it's that. So, um, you know, women, if you can, do it. Do it. It's a definite recommendation. And uh, it'll also help you lose some of that weight, you know. Um, for my fellas, man, look, just be patient. You children, try it. But I tell you what, I've been looking at children who haven't had their daddies around. 
And uh, if you got the chance to be in your son's life, do it. Know what I'm saying son, daughter too, man. For them children, they need it. And they appreciate it, man. So if you could be there for your for your for your little one, step up, be a man, man up, and uh, raise your children. All right, y'all be good.